You were sitting on sofa waiting for Jungkook to arrive as he is coming late nowadays. You start to get worried as his behavior has changed a lot since two weeks. You ignore it at first but now when he acts cold toward you which hurt you a lot. You was about to call him when you saw him entering the room. You sighed in relief and ran toward him and to take his coat you continued to walk. So you walk after him and ask, Vine, how was your day? You look tired. Jungkook, same as usual, nothing special. Vine, should I serve the dinner to you? Jungkook, no, I ate it from outside. Vine, why didn't you tell me like you always do? Jungkook, I am not a baby, you know that. Vine, okay, mm, so what happened today? Jungkook, what do you mean by that? I go to the meeting and check file and so much stuff. What else? He is sadly smart and known as he always used to overshare everything, but now he is acting changed. You take a deep breath when you saw him going away to his room. You follow him and stand in front of him. Vine, Jungkook, I want to talk to you about something. Jungkook, I am tired, Vine. Can we keep it for tomorrow? You think for a second before saying, Vine, okay, but I want to ask this. Did I do something wrong? Jungkook, no, you didn't do anything wrong. Vine, oh, I see. Then I will talk to you tomorrow about this. You must go to rest. You see and start going toward the kitchen. But stop when Jungkook says, Jungkook, don't think too much. Everything is fine. Vine, I'm not thinking about anything, honey. Jungkook, why are you going in the kitchen? Fine, I gotta clean the dishes. Jungkook, if you do water work this late, you might will get sick. Might will do it. Vine, I send them on holiday. Jungkook, what? Why did you do that? Vine, I stay alone all day without doing anything. That's why. Jungkook, I told you to rest now. I can do my work myself. I will clean my dishes which I used. Vine, but you didn't eat anything at home since three days, so there are none of your utensils. You say, try not to reflect your sadness to him. Jungkook, all right, then I'm going to bed. I will wait for you. Vine, no, don't wait for me. My wake is enough for us both. You smile and left to the kitchen without looking back at Jungkook, holding tear as you are so sensitive to holding back your tears. After an hour, you enter his share bedroom just to find Jungkook doing something by facing you. When you realize your presence, he hides something behind him and says, Jungkook, oh, you can't get changed and we will sleep together. Why, what are you hiding? Jungkook, it's just nothing. Don't worry, you go. He takes out his diary from behind and says, Jungkook, just writing something in it? Why, is that so? You don't have to hide it like that. It's not like I will interfere in your personal things. Jungkook sighed and ran towards you before covering your face and saying, Jungkook, you look tired. Go to sleep, okay? Vine, Jungkook, I love you. He flew and moved back from you, but you hold him again and hug him tightly. Vine, can I hug you today? Jungkook, yeah, he can. His words were soft, but the tone was cold, which was breaking you from inside. You hug you more tightly before saying, Vine, you are so warm, honey. Jungkook, here I am. Now sleep, okay? He nodded and left to bed while you follow him and lay beside him before saying, Vine, I will always love you and be by your side, honey. Jungkook, what else can I have for? You smile at his words and shift closer to him before saying, Vine, good night, honey. Have sweet dreams. He knees and fell to sleep while he continued to stare at him. A tear dropped fell from your eyes as you will start overthinking. Vine, B.O.B., I hope this is all just for a short time because I love the sweet side of you, dear. Want to be with you all the time and want you to share all the worries to me. The next day when you woke up, you found Jungkook was not beside you, nor in the washroom. You went downstairs, but he was not there either. You decided to call him. And soon, you pick it up. Vine, where are you, huh? Why did you leave without saying anything? Jungkook, I'm coming home. Don't worry. I just went to buy Will. As soon as the call get cut, you sang in relief at church when you hear the door drop sound, only to find him there. Jungkook, you don't have to worry that much. I'm not a kid. Why? But you act like one. Jungkook, I'm going to get ready now. Fine, okay. I'm preparing breakfast till that. He hmm and left from there, leaving his phone on the table. You sang and go to cook. You start preparing for breakfast when you view went toward Jungkook's phone. You shook up the thought and continued to cook. Curiosity took over you when a notification popped in his phone. You wipe your hand and pick his phone up just to see his ex name on screen. It was enough to shatter your heart. You looked. 
some courage and opened their chat just to find that his ex was begging him to come back and to leave him. He saw Jungkook's response was dry to her, but he got afraid as he knew how much he used to adore her. Tear formed in her eyes just by the thought of losing Jungkook. This was the last message which came just now. She has asked him to come to the nearby cafe around Jungkook's cupboard. You flinch badly while you hear Jungkook shout out. He quickly placed his foot back and wiped with tears before turning towards him. Why? Oh, you are ready. You look good. Wait a minute. I'm serving breakfast. Jungkook, did someone call on my phone? Why? I didn't hear anything, so I don't know. I was just putting it aside. He hummed and sat on the table and waited for his food to be served. After you complete serving him the food, you sit in front with blank face. Jungkook, what happened? Why are you not eating? Why? I'm not hungry right now. You eat? Jungkook, there's a strange foodie girl saying she is not hungry. You just smile at him while he continues to eat. He serves you food and says, Jungkook, eat it silently. He says in a neutral tone before finishing his food. Why? Are you going to come late today as well? Jungkook, don't know. If I did, please don't wait for me. Why? Whatever you say, I will still wait. You should go now or you might get late. He stared at you for a few seconds before leaving the house. You wave at him, saying bye. As soon as he disappears from your view, your eyes start getting teary. You continue to wipe them and console yourself that Jungkook is never going to leave you. But now there is so much fear in you that you decide to go to the place where Jungkook acts as called him. Thinking whether you will go or not, you wipe your tears and clean the dishes while losing yourself in your thoughts. Time skip to afternoon. You get ready and go to the same cafe where she has called Jungkook. You went earlier and sat in the corner wearing a mask and specs. You saw her entering the cafe with a trembling dress, but she was so pretty, which made you insecure about yourself. You continue to wait for Jungkook to arrive. It's the time skip he didn't show up. You sang in relief, thinking that he can't do anything wrong with you. You were getting up to leave when you saw him entering the cafe. Your eyes widened. You quickly turned. I will sit back. You saw both of them talking. You can hear his ex telling him to come back, but Jungkook stays silent. And in the end, he says, Jungkook, I don't want to be with you anymore. I am a wife. You said this and left from there, leaving his ex crying. You saw him coming back and handing her a napkin. Tears rolled in from your eyes, and you also left from there, cursing yourself for thinking wrong about him. Time skip. You enter your room and settle on bed. Why, how stupid of me to think that Jungkook will do that to me. But what if he still has feeling for her, but denied them just because I am his wife? As an overthinker, your imagination again take over you, that tree should be. Your girlfriend decides to open Jungkook's diary, which you never touched. You open the drawer and take out diary. You found the diary, and soon you open it just to find his ex name on the first page. As you start reading about her, do you form in your eyes, realizing how much you used to her? And how their relationship ended for some reason. You were having a panic attack and since childhood you were never once loved and the one who gave you love will also love someone else. Why no no it can't be he is my husband he adores me. You decide to rest your mind by sleeping so you lay back and soon you fell asleep. Jungkook, Tia I still love you so much I can't love Vine that much as much as I love you. Tia oh my Jungkook then let's stay together. Jungkook, yeah, why is with your girl? She will understand us. Tia, why don't you just divorce her? Jungkook smiled and known before kissing her, when suddenly something rings. You woke up and found yourself on bed, sweating badly. You look in your phone and found it was Jungkook. You saw, before picking up the call, Jungkook, I am coming home for lunch. Did you make something? Why, n- not yet. How much time will it take for you to arrive? Jungkook, I am just 10 minutes away. Should I... Bring something from outside. Why? No, no, I can go. He hmm and cut the call. You sang in relief and placed your phone next to your chest, realizing it was just a dream. You wash your face and leave to the kitchen to prepare lunch as fast as you can. After 15 minutes, Jungle arrived. He is holding a cake box. He placed it on the counter and says, Jungkook, someone gave this to me. It was your favorite, so I bring it home. He is in a cold zone without looking at you. Why? Food is nearly ready. Go get fresh up. He nodded and left. You took a look at cake and found a small hidden chit saying, For you, my love. It broke you. You shipped the cake away 
and served Jungkook food. Soon later, Jungkook came and saw Yeo sitting on the dining table silently. He sat in front of Yeo and said, Jungkook, you start having it first. Fine, I'm not hungry right now. I had something earlier. Jungkook, still eat some with me. Fine, Jungkook, I said that I want to talk to you about something last night. Can I say it now? Jungkook, sure, go ahead. Say I'm listening. Why and why are you acting like this? You saw him stop munching his food before saying, Jungkook, just because I'm work stressed, don't worry. Why and are you sure that's it? Jungkook, here it is, don't worry, and I'll eat your food. You look at him in desperation before picking up the spoon. Why and Jungkook, if you ever felt lonely, please tell me, I'm your wife. Jungkook, I always do, honey. You felt warm inside you as I call you honey after a week. After lunch, Jungkook left. You look at the cake before signing and leaving to your room. You settled on a pad and opened Instagram. While talking to your account, you found Jungkook and an old pic together, in which they were kissing, which was enough to make you jealous. You looked over your wedding photo, in which you were kissing him, and compared them. Vine, he looked more happy with her. Why I am having the feeling that they both are looking good enough for each other than me. He even gave her a napkin at the cafe. He must be stressed. You again start crying badly, remembering all the happy moments of him with you.